Culturally, it's really different. You know, it's, we're always racing Europe, and yeah, even the climbs are different. I remember last year we're coming down to Sense, and in Europe you kind of know what what sort of corners coming. Here, it's it can throw a hairpin at you that just bends around the side of a mountain. Yeah, first stage here is uh, just looking flat. It's a long day, but. I don't know, it's looking like a, it's going to end up in a bank sprint. And yeah, getting ready for, for the coming days. A bit hilly, there are some mountain stages to come, so let's try to chill a little bit today, through the legs, and, and do a little bit of work in the final. Everyone's a bit jet lagged. I was up at 4 a.m. this morning. That was it, I was awake. So, uh, yeah, it is different. You have to compromise a bit on just about everything. Obviously, that there is our team bus. It's a bit different to the normal, normal comfort, um, but everyone's in the same boat, so it's kind of it's a bit different. It's an experience. Yeah, you know, we get to see the Great Wall of China. Nah, it was alright. I mean. It was a pretty easy race to be honest. You know, a small break went, which was perfect. So we sort of, uh, I mean, you know, we got 43 km an hour average, which you know, is sort of shifting along nicely, but it's, uh, it wasn't too strenuous. Then obviously the finish was the finish was rapid, but that was always going to be the case. I think you know, it's sort of it's a double-edged sword. If you have an easy easy main part of the stage, it means the last bit's absolute nuts. Ah, of course, I want to try and get a result for myself, and I just need to keep keep racing aggressive, and you know, like I said, take my chances, and you know, I always you always need a little bit of luck, so I just have to wait for the day, you know, when I get that little bit of luck, and then see what happens. Just coming to the finish, the last like thirty k, I was just knackered. <coughs> oh well. Completely different. You're in Asia, and um, yeah, you see the crowd. Like when you cross the town, they're pretty excited about watching the race. But, um, but it's totally different. Of course, it's totally different bringing cycling to to Asia. It's going to be super stressful, I think it's be interesting because it's quite short as well, you know, only 150k could, uh, could make it a fast stage. Oh, it's feeling pretty strong there, so uh, yeah, it was nice to, nice to do a good job and then Nice that um, well Benyat can finish it off. Yeah, it's, there's no better feeling than that. It's, we all feel like we've won today. There'll be no celebrating tonight. Um, yeah, it's not over till it's over. Anything could happen tomorrow. There's, there's more. It's 10 seconds up for grabs on the line. There's bonifications in between. I think. Uh, yeah, we really gotta gotta be on our toes. It's gonna be more of the same tomorrow. Just riding the front and uh, doing doing what we can.
rate, like letting the break go, getting the right sort of, there was a group, big group of like 10 went and it was uh, <coughs> difficult. We had to pull that back and then uh, after that, yeah, just, you know, Jesus, um, Andre and Visconti just controlled it, kept it. You know, we got just under 30 mile an hour average for today, so it was uh, fast. And then at the end it just got hectic, so we were just controlling, uh, just trying to keep Benyat up there, but flipping out, that was a fast finish. I mean, a maximum speed of 66k an hour for today, and it was pan flat, so. It's good. Time for a bit? Or six. <laughs> so, yeah, I've done it. And I just finished the last race of my life. and It's quite special here. I never done the, I was thinking about it. I never did any Olympic Games and finishing in front of the Olympic Stadium in Nigeria is quite, quite a special, special thing too. And you got in the break, how, how was that? Well, I, <laughs> It was funny because at the before the start we were talking with Pinori about it. Could go on the breakaway. I said, "Well, listen, I've done enough breakaways in my life. I'm not even thinking about it." And then I just did the start attacking and I just follow one attack, one move, and that was a good one. So I was lucky at the end. Uh, just holidays now. Enjoy, enjoy what I've what I've done. I heard a rumor you were going to go surfing or something. Nah, windsurfing. I love windsurfing a lot. I go to Maui. I used to go to Maui. For holidays a lot and winter for there, so I hope to have great conditions for the coming months. Panda Corner is the uh, the Chinese equivalent of uh, Dutch Corner or Irish Corner. This is where the panda comes out to cheer on the riders.